sauna vlog. This is where I sit in infrared heat and sweat bullets to detox my body, clear my mind, and connect with spirit during my meditations. And so it's really coming handy in this intense energy that we've been going through. It's all about taking time for yourself to remember your what your path is here, what your point is here, and what you're passionate about and what you need to do to get there if you're not there, right? I'm already sweating. It's uh, already 137 degrees in here. And I got about 40 minutes to go. So, um, but I wanted to talk quickly about some, there's quite a few spiritual laws that will help us um, manifest what we want in this life while we're incarnated here in this dimension. Sorry. <laughs> and, um, one of the things that's really important to know before you even delve in to all the spiritual laws, which I can go in and I will do subsequent vlogs and talk about everyone or everyone that I know. But, um, it's really important to understand, and I may have mentioned this before in passing in one of my other vlogs, but we all have free will, right? So part of the manifesting process is really understanding what free will is and that gift that we were given when we incarnated here. I'm sorry, I'm just completely sweating. Like I said, I have, it's 137 degrees already. Um, and I'm just sweating bullets. <laughs> I have about 40 minutes to go. Um, so understanding free will, okay? What is free will? Free will means no matter what you're dealing with, you have a choice, okay? So say you're dealing with a catastrophe and you had no choice in that catastrophe. Well, the reality is you did because you didn't have to choose to do that, go that direction or be in that place. Now, people will say, oh, well, for example, the devastating fires, how did I have a choice in that? Well, you didn't have to live in California. Okay, so it all boils down to choices and being responsible for your choices because all our choices got us here, right? So free will means that in any given moment, and so I do psychic readings, right? But I tell clients that because we have the gift of free will, that no matter what I see for a future, there's a number of different futures that are possible because of free will. And say, for example, I'll say to a client, well, if you do this, this is what looks likely to happen. But if you do something else, then that future is going to become less probable and change. So we're always in control of our future because of the decisions we make. So it's really critical to understand that so that when you're making decisions, whether they seem important or not, there's always ramifications. For every action, there's a reaction. And that's one of the spiritual laws. I mean, so understand that as well. So we have the choice. We have the power. We have the ability to change our life based on our decisions in every single moment. So what I say is always come from a place of the heart. Always come from your highest vibration. When you're making choices, what makes you feel good? What makes you feel alive? What resonates from your heart chakra is the right thing to do, okay? And then there's reactions, which is also a choice, okay? So everything that we engage in, we can choose how to react. If somebody's coming at us with anger and craziness, we can choose to engage and take the vibration for both of us down, or we can choose to disengage and come from a place of the heart and be happy still and not let that person or, uh, you know, situation bring us down. Okay. So we always, always, always have a choice. This is profound because if we understand this, then we understand the power that we have in our lives. Okay. And we understand that every time we think and everything that we do, has ramifications on our life, right? So keep your thoughts positive, keep your words positive at all costs, your writings and correspondence always positive. 
come from your heart and know that you're in control of your future in every moment. We are the manifestors. We are the creators. Okay, so I'm going to meditate now. Really focus on what I want in my life and manifesting that. And peace.